I'm in, enjoying uh, being a, a senior citizen of the industry. I was really touched with this honor, you know, I really was. It, it was I didn't find out about it until about less than a, less than a week ago. And it really mean, meant a lot to me, you know. I realized I don't do much publicity unless it's for a movie. You do sometimes feel forgotten. <clears throat> it would be the acting career um, I'm the proudest about only because I had to succeed my father and my father's career. My grandfather was a ragman's. So my father's career went from total poverty to being a movie star. I was born when he was already a movie actor and a movie star. So my arc supposedly is not as big dramatically, but the reality is it's much harder to be a second, a second generation. People, t you, see, you see that? It's just like your father. It's just like your father. Well, thank you very much. Oh, you look, you sound just like your father. So these are all things in a business where you're trying to establish your own identity. And um, uh, the producing was a surprise to me. I, I had no intention, except I read this book, One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest, and I said, this is fantastic. And when I saw there was an opportunity to have control of this material, and then my, that was my first producing movie, and it was a big success, so it started me out on a career. And the, the funny part of it was, as a producer, but as an actor, because I had done a television series, I was not allowed to be in the movies, my movies. So I had some movies that I produced in the, in the beginning. For instance, there was a movie called Starman that Jeff Bridges played. I wanted to play that part, but the studio, I was not accepted as a film actor. So finally, with, uh, with Wall Street and winning an Oscar for Best Actor, I was able to step out of the shadow of my father and, and feel confident. It's taken a, a long time, but I am I'm convinced, that, uh, and I'm very proud of the fact that there's, there's not many second-generation Actors or actresses, there's, there's a few, and we we share that. But my father had a, a lengthy career. Unfortunately, he never won an Oscar, although I think he deserved one, certainly with The Lust for Life, the movie Van, Van Gogh. So there's a little luck involved. But yes, I, I, I'm i enjoying uh, being a, a senior citizen of the industry. But I'm taking a break. Um, I, Spent the last eight months here in, in France uh, playing Benjamin Franklin for an Apple limited series. And I, and I had some health issues coming in. And I just generally want to take a break for a while. I want to focus more on my public service, working on my areas. I, you know, I'm a messenger of peace with the United Nations in the area of disarmament. I want to focus more on disarmament, focus more on our political issues and problems. In, in the U.S. and so unless something really special comes up, I don't have any plans on working for the next year.